Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Trophy Nuts, and welcome back to XCOM Enemy Within in the Valkyrie playthrough. Which, as you can st see, still means we only use female soldiers. Uh, so sadly, we had to let Zhang, the amazing heavy, we get for free go because he's a man. Um, after that, we got attacked by a medium UFO, which we barely got to shut down. To shoot down uh, that's where the experimental warfare research is coming in because we'll be able to uh, get rid of ufos a lot more quickly and more efficiently so we did get to manage it to get it down we did manage to get it down so uh we can go kill a lot of aliens because it's a medium ufo which means it's bigger than the one before so yeah go go squad So while the assaults got their laser rifles next. equipped, the threat there seems to be the most pressing. so the range is a lot more better than with a shotgun. And this should give us a lot more materials as well. Okay, there was one missing, I think. Come in, HQ. Okay, we're still with five people. Approaching the crash site now. Strike team is awaiting your orders. Affirmative, Big Sky. Strike one is free to engage hostile targets at the crash site. Yeah, we would be. I'm on the move. So I'm gonna try and spread them out a position. bit. Affirmative. Put everyone into full cover. Okay. And. Maybe I should try and find the UFO, so the fire is over here, so that generally means that the UFO should be in this direction as well. As you can see, this map is huge! So, as before, there will probably be a few cuts to get the video moving, moving but there we go. Sectoids, funny enough, um, which of course doesn't really mean anything, but uh, is that full? Heading yeah, out. Full. Nothing yet. We'll that's try and put Weiss a bit further, which should be the last one we put away that far. So of I'm course. Could always get jumped by anything. Out. Shh. You hear that? Enemy spotted. Oh, and we get attacked from the back. They're flanking my position. Got, got him. And Target's still up. Apparently they shot one really far off. Okay. Oh bam! The Dan Shini has They're earned a promotion! Okay, that's weird. They were hiding in a sort of canyon, what the hell? So as assault, we could get closer and shoot his face off. Don't want to waste all my running guns yet. But I do want to try and get Texas to get a kill. So go for running gun, dash to that full cover. And then shoot the alien with a 38% shot, which will miss. Not. Okay, that was extremely lucky. Yeah, booyah indeed. Um, so we're gonna keep... We've seen there's something coming from over there, and it sounded like sectoids as well. Which is actually in our advantage because sectoids only have three health and with our new laser rifles they will die when we hit them aye, aye. oh so the second sectoid died because Weiss has the uh, sentinel perk which allows her to uh, perform two overwatch shots I kind of missed that uh, the only one we should get closer right now is of course um, I might be turned around now no, okay, no, it was Solid that direction. 
a bit confused why uh, Ruby is at this weird position, but I was thinking to go that direction, and that's why she's over there. There we go. Get out of the woodworks. They might be attracted by the gunfire from uh, us killing those other sectoids. Their brethren, Moving to as position. you wish. Okay. Let's so maybe spread Fire out Commander. a bit more. Roger that. Look sharp. Enemies rolling out. There we go. There are the sectoids. I'm gonna pull back with Texas because she's in a bad spot. Um, we could put our heavy a bit Affirmative. closer. Ruby has a nice shot down this alley, so I'm gonna put her on Overwatch. And everybody else as well. Except for Texas. We'll probably have some mine melts. Did you hear something? Okay. That's bullshit, but Okay, he misses. That was close. That should have triggered something. I didn't hear any mind melt, which means I'm gonna have to take a risk. And that should probably get shot at. Yeah, there we go. But of course, Overwatch shots have a higher chance of missing. But that was a mind meld, apparently. And that is the one that's mind melding. So we might get to change this around on them. Go Texas! Ah, okay. You missed your shot at a promotion. Target still up. Yes, target still up. So I'm gonna try if. Uh... Huh. We do have three sectoids we need to take care of. Uh, one of which is behind full cover. And I can't really reach from here. I'm gonna try something a bit awkward. To that location. There are no Overwatch shots anymore. But I have a really nice shot with Yang from over here. 89% and it misses. Okay. This is annoying. Heading to that location. 67. I'm counting on 67 shots right now. Commander. 82! This needs to hit, otherwise I'm fucking screwed. Maybe even rapid fire. That's 67 on each one. Oh, thank god. Dead and gone. Okay. So now the only problem we still have is that one tiny little sectoid that's still creeping around over there. The only shot I have is a 67 shot, which I'm gonna have to take, and fuck, okay, I'm gonna have to take this in the oh, face, because this won't help us either. So there's a lot of guys just in the open, wow, oh fuck! Okay. And now something's gonna die. Okay, she just panicked. Please hunker down and don't shoot anybody else. Okay. Okay, 
Nothing happened. Uh, we know he's not on Overwatch, so I'm gonna just take the smart thing and just flank the bitch and hopefully not trigger anything else. And apparently... What? Fuck you. Really, really, fuck you. Just, just because I hate you. Just because I hate you. Eat this. There we go. No risks. Not taking any risks. And I'm gonna just... Politely heal Texas. There you go. Nothing happened. Stop panicking. And I put Ruby on top here. So she finally... Okay, surfing that one. Finally can shoot something. Yeah. I would want to reload, but I can't even reload you after a running gun. It's probably because of this ledge that she couldn't step out on this side and look at that. But that doesn't mean you can't look out with that thing. So we lost one meld already. That's affirmative. I'm gonna move Blake back Reloaded. towards what probably is the UFO over here. I'm still not seeing it. Because we've been in a lot of tussles around this place. Position confirmed. Okay, nothing. Heading there now. Let's keep it that way. I'm on the move. For now. Rock and roll. And reload who he can. Scanning. Yeah, there's the UFO. So the battle scanner reveals everything. Was that? Yeah, people Back inside. So we killed six enemies already. So I'm really doubting whether there is still something else inside that UFO. But we'll soon find out. So after a lot of painstakingly slow turns, we're uh, halfway through the UFO. Heading to that location. We lost all the meld. So, uh, that's not really handy. Moving. But hey. But we're almost where we want to be. So I'm gonna purposefully trigger Solid this copy. door. So they start panicking. The aliens, that Stepping is. Off. Put everyone in position. And hopefully, something comes screaming through the door. So we can take it out really easily. But of course, it's if it's only the crystal dudes left, that's not going to happen. The since we need to trigger that. Could prove to be extremely useful in our own research. Please take great care in returning it to the base in one the piece. canister this far inside of the UFO. Well, that's something I haven't seen before. So there's two options for this thing to spawn. It can spawn over here, or it can spawn inside of this place. That's affirmative. So I'm going to put her here. Well, it didn't trigger over there, so I'm going to assume it's not going to. Although I'm going to move Heading cautiously. Since, of course, there can still be other aliens inside of this place. Will do. Sniper. Rolling Let's out. put her over here. And then Texas can also... Uh, Moving move to, to this corner. So yeah, I think it's pretty clear that it's that? inside of the main uh, area. So I'm gonna do what I always do in this scenario. I'm gonna put on my way. soldiers on both sides of the door. I'm gonna rush the heavy over Our here. Ass. Oh Don't fuck. Over here. Okay, never mind. Was a bit too fast on that one. 
Um, doesn't mean we don't have options, of course. Um, we can still run and gun. Just blast this thing in the face. With Texas. She still needs that promotion badly. I'm gonna Moving put her over here. And just fry his ass. Thank you! Excellent work. Excellent work, uh, of complete. course. Only seven enemies. I would expect more. We could have had more, but we were pretty lucky. So, Operation Bleeding Stranger done. And hopefully we get a lot of undamaged stuff from that medium UFO. Because that just means more money for us. Oh, wow. Promotions all the way. We have four captains now. And Texas promoted to, uh, what's this, Corporal, probably? Corporal, yeah. So, Captain number one. Uh, sprinter for a sniper or damn good ground? Well, we don't really have to move her around with squad sides. I'm gonna go for damn good ground, which gives us 10 aim and 10 defense extra when we're higher than the enemy. Twice. Dance smoke or combat drugs? This is a, a fixed one. Uh, I always pick dance smoke because it has saved us quite a bit right now. And her aim is a whopping 99. Then, Blake. Savior. Uh, where we can use. Uh, where medkits restore 4 more health per use. Or bring them on. Um, I don't know. It's really stupid for me to give Blake a mad kid uh, so the 4 health won't really do anything um, I also skipped the revive so uh, we missed out on that one as well if we wanted to make her a healer so I'm gonna I think for the first time choose bring them all which adds one damage on critical hits for each enemy the squad can see it's a really annoying one because you need the critical hit and we have to see a lot of enemies which we obviously don't want but hey it would add one damage on the enemy on every critical of course so bring them on next one Texas corporal finally I was waiting for that one we have lightning reflexes which allows the first reaction shot uh, will miss on her so we can use her to draw out overwatch shots uh, without risking anything and then we have Yang Rapid reaction. Confers a second reaction shot if on Overwatch and the first reaction shot is a hit or danger zone. Uh, I usually go for danger zone because danger zone uh, increases the area of effect of uh, rocket attacks and suppression as well. We don't use suppression, but I think the rockets alone. Mm -hmm. Rapid reaction is again one that's really conditional since we need to hit the first reaction shot. And uh, if we, we set up our reaction shots really nicely, we don't even need a second reaction shot. So danger zone it is. That's it. That was really nice. So Texas is out for six days because of that shot she took to the face. But I'll take that above getting her killed any day. So, two other medals. Six sectoid corpses, 33 Illyrium, 105 alloys, which we're gonna need, uh, 12 weapon fragments, 2 intact flight computers, 1 intact power source, and that means there's a lot of damage, so 2 damaged flight computers and 1 damaged power source. We're gonna, of course, sell those uh, damaged ones. I'm gonna keep. Mm, we need 2 for the research, so I'm gonna sell. Uh, I'm gonna not sell anything, so there we go, 70. Uh, no Tin Man, we have a few Sectoid Corpses, but uh, we're gonna be encountering them less and less, so I'm gonna need those. Uh, I'm gonna even leave 17, because we need one for the autopsy, I think. Yeah, we've been picking up some odd transmissions lately. Some nut calling himself Commander Straker has been all over the news ranting about shadow operatives. Okay, so with that done, we do have a bit more money to hire soldiers. 
and the uh, promotions I'm just thinking were so fast because we put uh, wet work in the officer training school so that is panning out really nicely so continue scanning and now Jessica Jones is out of surgery and she lost all her lady parts the cybernetic interfaces are holding stable but they're of no use without a cyber suit to interface with but of course we do get a mech in exchange for that we manufacture one immediately when our new mech trooper equips that suit I think you'll be pleasantly surprised with its capabilities the progress on a mech trooper is reset so she uh, she goes back to being a, a rookie or a squaddy I think and uh, but that allows us to keep leveling her so now we can go to mech inventory and build a mech for only 25 credits, which is really weird, I think. But we do need 40 melt. We have 100 left. So there we go. Um, the flamethrower is really nice, but I, uh, I don't really use that all that much. So I'm gonna go for the kinetic strike module, which not only gives us an incredibly powerful melee strike, I think it does 12 damage, but it also boosts our mobility uh, making the mech the fastest unit on the field we have so far. So, in Epic Strike. So the only thing we need to do then is go to uh, Jessica's tree, and check out the ability, which gives us the ability of collateral damage, which uh, allows us to shoot at an area and not just a single object. So then we go to loadout and equip her nicely blue colored Next Thank you, Shen. So, uh, as Shen just mentioned, we can also use the strike module to uh, eliminate cover. And she keeps her 72 aim, gets a bit more defense, and uh, 8 HP extra, which will make her the most resilient one we have. So, still four rookies we need to train, hopefully a bit more in a minute. Um, we still have five days till the end of the month. I'm gonna assign those medals we got. So still the five defense one when in cover. Um, we'll give that to Ruby. Thank you. And then the International Service, which gives a plus two aim per continent bonus. We'll give that aim bonus to our mech. Because she'll be able to use anything based on uh, aim bonuses. Which will also give her that uh, Council Medal if we can. Because that adds another 10 aim. So, two more days for new soldiers and the Experimental Warfare. Which I hope we get to. Oh, another abduction before the end of the month. For assistance. There are abductions in progress at each marked site on the Hologlobe. So, again, we're split between uh, Europe, America and Asia. So, China, United States and Russia. We got a recruit from the United States and four engineers from China. And I think we're gonna have to take Russia again. Let's check out the situation here. Um, Russia would allow us to keep this limited and swap our interest to the United States and Canada which I do want to take the risk of we can use the scientists we're gonna get from Russia so I think Russia it is we've been really friendly with uh, Europe um, but it has been out of necessity so let's go do that Russia it is, Novgorod, a very difficult mission, which, which means that we're gonna have uh, a lot of enemies there. But since we're not at the end of the second month yet, uh, we only will encounter sectoids, tin men, seekers or floaters. Uh, none of the mutants that we uh, have seen in friends with in low places will spawn here. So, our first mission with our mech trooper in hand. Uh, a really balanced team right now. 
I would want to bring a rookie. And I'm not really sure because actually Jones is a squaddy right now, so we, uh, we will be able to uh, level her up a bit faster. And we're gonna need that because Max can be really handy. Uh, we, they have really high damage output next to the strike module as well with that minigun, so. Okay, next mission abduction site in Russia. So thank you guys enormously for watching. If you liked the video, don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more. So thank you guys again for watching and I hope to see you in the next video. Goodbye!